All right, yo, it's time for me to get hard. <clears throat> Let's do this shit. Hello everyone, this is 22 Tiger Dude here and I'm here to review Get Hard. So Get Hard stars Will Ferrell, Kevin Hart, Alison Brie, and Craig T. Nelson. And this film is about this millionaire named James King. Life is going very good for him, but then life hits him in the face one day when he's arrested for apparently being a fraud of embezzling a lot of money. Now he has to go to prison, so he has 30 days to pretty much get everything in order before he goes to prison so then Kevin Hart who is in charge of washing cars and Will Ferrell asks Kevin Hart if he could prep him for prison because apparently just because Kevin Hart is black that's why Will Ferrell asks for his help so Kevin Hart agrees to help Will Ferrell prep for prison and what can you expect shenanigans ensue so I'm going to be honest with you guys, I really was not looking forward to Get Hard. And that's just because the trailers just didn't impress me. Get Hard is one of the worst movies of this year, you guys. And in fact, you know what? I'm going to show you how much I really don't like this movie. <sighs> Goodness gracious, this movie sucked. But let me get into the positive side, of course, because that's what I gotta do. I gotta look at the positive side first, right? So the first positive is that there are some funny moments into this movie. Yes, there are some moments that did make me laugh, and most of those moments come from Kevin Hart. But Kevin Hart in general, he was enjoyable here, even when he's given some things that didn't quite work for him. T.I. has a very small role in Get Hard, but I actually did think he does a good job in the movie. He made me laugh a couple of times, and he was, you know, he was pretty good. Craig T. Nelson, good to see him again. It's been a while, but yeah, nice to see you again, Craig T. Nelson. Too bad it had to be in a shitty movie, but it's good to see you again. And Alison Brie, I thought she did do a very nice job. But now let's get to what I absolutely hated about Get Hard. The writing is terrible. It's lazy. And a lot of the jokes in this movie are just so forced. And like even when there would be a funny moment and get hard, the moment will be funny. It's like, huh, that's funny. And then they drag it on. It's all like, okay, we get it. And then they drag it on. It's like, okay, we get it. And then they drag it. It's like, okay, I get it. I get it. Will Ferrell was annoying and he was forced. And I'm not the biggest Will Ferrell fan, I really am not, but I don't hate the guy, and I could tell Will Ferrell tries, but he tries way too hard. They go through a lot of stereotypes into this movie, in which I don't get offended, honestly. I, I can honestly say I wasn't offended watching this movie, but it was just how they incorporated all of this humor that just doesn't fit with the movie so well. Like there will be certain jokes where I wouldn't get offended, but it's all like, okay, you really have to bring in that stereotype into this without getting any details. They show a split second shot of a penis. Wow, cameraman, just wow. Was that really necessary? Like just, was that really necessary? And then as the movie goes on, oh my God, it gets so stupid. I, I like to laugh at stupid things. I'm not going to deny that. I do. There's some stupid movies I could watch and just laugh at. But this movie, yes, it has its moments of being so stupid it's funny. But a lot of the parts, it gets so stupid that my head hurts. And then it gets predictable. I mean, I don't like predictability. I've said that hundreds of times. But when you're bored watching this movie, when you're aggravated watching this movie, you just can't help but just point out the predictability because that's all you have left when you're not invested into the movie. And I was not invested into Get Hard. It's a lazy as hell movie. There's a huge lack of heart in this movie and even when it does try to be slightly heartwarming in moments it becomes false. Absolute false. 
The editing in this movie was really choppy at times too. Just the execution on the jokes as a whole falls flat miserably. So overall, I thought Get Hard was a terrible movie. It feels so forced a lot of times. Will Ferrell really gets on my nerves. It feels choppy with its editing, the storyline, the writing, the direction, it all fails. There are funny moments here and there in Get Hard, but honestly, it just really annoyed me and frustrated me just sitting through this movie. So I'm going to give Get Hard one and a half out of four stars. Almost a one, I'm not gonna lie, but one and a half just because of Kevin Hart. He does save the movie just a little bit for me. How do you guys feel about Get Hard? Did you think it was actually a funny movie? Did you like the movie? Did you hate the movie like I did? Yeah, let me know, you guys. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power. Yeah, peace, yo.